It said, using a printed fingerprint copy can unlock a fingerprint lock. Hit like and drop a comment if you're clever enough to think of that idea yourself. Mythbusters decided to put it to the test by replacing their neighbor's old mechanical lock with a high-tech fingerprint lock, the kind that uses an optical sensor to scan and match fingerprints. They started by printing Jamie's fingerprint on paper and scanning it into the system. The result? Total failure. A flat image just couldn't fool the sensor. Next, they took it up a notch by creating a 3D fingerprint mold using acetate and tissue gel. This time, after a few seconds of scanning, the lock clicked open, proving that a detailed enough replica can indeed bypass the system. Then, Adam tried using Grant's fingerprint lifted from an old CD and made a latex copy. It didn't work at first. But after he licked the latex slightly, the lock opened instantly. Apparently the added moisture helped with conductivity and fooled the biometric reader. They even tested a simple photocopy of the fingerprint, and unbelievably it still worked. So, the rumor turned out to be true, and now you've learned a new hack. But are these smart locks really smart, or just an expensive illusion of convenience?